Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 13. I'm coming to you in all my glory with my bed head. I did sleep with that hair makeup in my hair so I could show you. I think maybe if I turn my hair down or head down. But it's not coming off on my hand. As a precaution, I put on a dark blue pillowcase last night. And I'm going to go ahead and insert some photos from yesterday when my hair looked better and I had makeup on. Charlie never noticed either that or he saw it and just thought I was doing something silly to my hair and didn't bother to comment on it. Either way, he never said a word about my rose gold hair. It's definitely more noticeable at the top where I think I put maybe a little bit too much on, but it was fun and I'll do it again. Today's a work day. I need to get ready. I need to have breakfast, but I wanted to open my advent calendar with you. So let me get my Beyond the Pink Door advent calendar. So here's my Beyond the Pink Door advent calendar. I'm looking for where Day 13, let's see, 14, 16. I'm trying not to handle them too much because I like to guess. Four. There it is. Feels like might be some snaps. Open it up. I am a good guesser today. Andrea has put a real nice assortment of things in the box. I will see you. Good later. morning, everybody. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 14. As you can see, I've washed my hair and all of that rose gold came out. I do need to wash these hair clips. I'm gonna spray them down with some cleaner, let them soak a little bit. Hopefully just spray them off. It was fun and I think I'll do it again. It was not as waxy creamy as I expected, which is a good thing. I did lay it on a little too thick, but it was fun. So you will notice that I am combining days 13 and 14 together. I had a very long day yesterday. We had a meeting after work that was supposed to go until 7.30. So I thought, I'm just going to combine two videos, and I didn't have a whole lot going on. Let's open the Beyond the Pink Door Advent Calendar. Here's my Advent Calendar. We're looking for day 14. 15, 23, 17, 16, 22. Here's 14. Not a clue. Feels like some type of case. Maybe it snips. It's kind of elongated. Let's open it up and see. It's a button maker. So let's see, suitable for hemline metal self-cover buttons. I believe in the US hemline is Dritz. Oh, that's really handy. I do self-cover buttons occasionally. And it's got various different sizes all in one. Super handy, thanks Andrea. Today's gonna be a really busy day for me. I need to buckle down and get some things done. So I'll be on here a little bit, I think, because some of it is sewing, but it's gonna be a short filming slash editing day. Not that I've been spending a ton of time editing during Vlogmas, but I have a lot that I need to do. I've got the dentist this morning, then I have to clean up my sewing room, which has become a bit of a dumping ground 
We've got gifts that are needing to be wrapped. I've got a car seat in there. It's a mess. I need to hold a pause on sewing my dress because I need to make sure I get these Hudson pants sewn up. That is the only thing we have for the grandchildren to open while they're here at our house. And I wanna make sure they have something to open. So dress needs to go on the back burner. I need to tidy things up. I'm thinking about batch cutting and batch sewing. I typically don't like to do that just because I like to start and finish a project, but I may end up doing that just so that I can make sure that I am using my pattern pieces wisely so I can get as much as I can out of that fabric. I am sewing up a size eight, seven, four, and two. So that's what I've got planned for today. And I need to get busy. I'll see you back in just a little bit. Bye. accomplished today. I started with the not as fun tasks. I got all of our linens sorted out, the bedding for when the family comes into town. I've done some menu planning, made my grocery list. I tidied up the sewing room. It is not tidy, but it's definitely in much better working order. And that's where I spent the bulk of my time today. And I've cut out the two pattern sizes that I didn't already have cut out for the Hudson pants. Now in the mini sizes, I have sizes two, three, four, five, seven, eight, and 10 cut out. <laughs> I'm only lacking size six. I'm gonna start batch cutting my Hudson pants tonight. I don't know how far I'll get. I'll just do as much as I can and tomorrow is a work and a so day. See you tomorrow.